This is Ursus' helmet. I thought she died in the field below, but must have been here. All this trickery. For what? Feels like it's just a torch in me. I have a theory. But it takes a little imagination. So far, your theories are better than other people's facts. All right. I think the Asaram ambushed Ursa and her men with a new weapon. They mounted it on that tripod up there. It fires waves of force, maybe sound. Looks like it cracked the stone there. I think it paralyzes people instead of killing them. It dropped the vanguard right there. No blood on their weapons. No fight. But why paralyze them if you're only gonna move them and gut them? They were trying to hide something. Look here, a bloody rock. That they used to smash Ursa's face in. Or someone else's. These leather straps have been cut, as if they took the armor off someone. Uh, that, that can't be. Her body is, is lying in state in Meridian. I saw it. You said she was unrecognizable. Maybe they switched another body into her armor, someone around the same size, and mutilated it enough so it could have been anyone, even Ursa. Go back to Meridian. Take another look at that body. If it's really Ursa, of course I'm wrong. But if I'm right... Then, then my sister could be alive. I, I, I'm going. Meet me back there when you can. Greetings, Aloy. I am known as Blameless Marad. Please come with me. You're needed for an important consultation. What do you mean? Where's Erend? He's inside, attending the Sun King, where we should be without further delay. That's good. I have something urgent to tell the King. Then you shall have your chance. Follow me, please. I think you'll find him to be a reasonable man. Aloy of the Nora, she who sees the unseen. Welcome. It would seem you have done me a great service. Erend, tell her what you found. I, I checked Ursa's tomb. You were right, Aloy. The body is missing a scar below her right knee. I gave it to Ursa when we were kids, fighting over a toy sword. If the body is not Ursa's, then we must assume she is still alive. And I will not abandon her. We only know she was taken, not who took her. I can help with that. Ursa has an enemy among the Oseram. A warlord named Durval. Impossible. Every clan in the claim has been hunting for him since the liberation. He has to be dead by now. No other Asuram had the motive and ingenuity to lure Ursa into this trap. I expect to find him lurking somewhere near the border. I've already sent an agent to investigate. He'll be waiting for word from us at the marketplace in Pitchcliffe. I can't move troops to the border without provoking the Asuram. But I could send a few vanguardsmen. And perhaps an exceptionally gifted Nora as well. Errant, Murad, 
Let me discuss it with her privately. I hate to impose further after all you've done, but this is a matter of great importance to me. I need to get going. I know. Well, they say kings should never beg. But please, help me find Ursa. Who says that? Well, Murad, for one. Don't hesitate to ask him or Erend if you have further questions. Murad's agent should be at the marketplace by now. No sign of Marat's guy. He's had plenty of time to investigate. We'd better look for him. Damn right. Has to be Marat's guy. Durval's thugs must have made him. Maybe because he found something. Look at this. I think he drew a map with his own blood. Right. Those kind of maps you know you better follow. That might be Pitchcliff. He marked a spot to the north. Could be Durval's location. My men are waiting outside of town. I'll grab them and meet you there. Looks like they've been chained up. Durval's a tinker. He probably experiments on them, or strips them for parts. Maybe I can use them to make some trouble. I'll go in first. Hold off until the fighting starts. All right. We've got your back. Durval's men. It's about to get over. Intruders! Unleash the machine! Shoot their chains!
one canker less in the world. You're not gonna see it coming. Nerval says you gotta eat dirt. to get through. They must use these to protect themselves from that awful sound. Durval try to break me. Shows what he knows. I, sh I should have been with you. Why didn't you come for me? I, I know I'm a useless trunk, but... No, idiot. I got a message from Durval saying he wanted to parlay. I didn't come for you because I knew it was a trap. I couldn't let you get hurt. Just didn't think it'd be that good a trap. Thought I could take him out. <laughs> no. Now listen. Durval's planning something big in Meridian. He said he'd force Avad to watch as the smoke darkens their precious sun. Your king needs you. No more playing around. You're gonna have to grow up fast. I will. I promise. You damn well better, little brother. Ursa. No, no. Please. I won't let you down. I promise. Aaron, I'm... I'm so sorry. You've got to find Durval. But Meridian's a big place. I'll... Uh, I'll look through his things. Maybe we can narrow it down. 